Double. Drag it. It's your boy A Man. It's your boy Like It. We'll be back with some new heat for y'all today. You heard what she said. Let's get it, man. Back with One Piece. Towards the end of the season. Well, yeah. saga or arc, whatever y'all want to call it. Right. What episode we start? Like 207, 207, 206? For Water 7? Well, just this whole saga in general. 20 something. Man, it's been 100 episodes plus. And it's been a journey. Yeah. I'm it's afraid. I'm afraid. Well, I'm not afraid, but I'm, but I'm, but I'm hopeful that I've learned watching One Piece that I'm, I'm hungry for that world building, <laughs> for that main story, and I think that's part of the reason I enjoyed Water Seven slash In His Lobby. I enjoyed that a lot because it pertained to the main story a lot, mm -hmm. not like some of the other arcs. Even though it's technically is the main story, it's canon, but not the main objective. You know what I'm saying? Right. So. I'm hoping that the next, you know, Saga's arcs contains those. Like, whether it's a little bit, to kind of keep my focus on it. Right. But I'm going to remain hopeful. I'm not going to, like, downplay it just yet. That's crazy. I think I'm going to go ahead and do my rating now for Alabasta versus Water 7 in this lobby arc. Alabasta versus Water not 7? Alabasta. Um, I mean, you could technically... Scott, Scott Pia. Yeah. I know you already said it was better. It was, before we even got to end this live, you already Hands said down. it. And I was going to wait till the end of it. Now it's the end. And I'm going to officially say, man, that this is better than Scott Pia, for sure. Um, I thought Scott Pia was going to be hard to beat. Mm -hmm. And Water 7 kind of blew it out the water, in a sense. It just has so much stuff, man. The stuff that the Straw Hats went through amongst themselves with Luffy, Usopp. The freaking uh, suspensefulness from the CP9 stuff, the whole Robin stuff, finding yep. out her backstory and how that ties to like the whole kind of like main plot too. Um, CP9 people's dis deceiving us, Kaku, my heart broken. You know what I'm saying? Like the Luffy, Rob Luffy, Luffy fight, Mary. This has so much, G. So much. He ain't even finished naming everything. The uh, Zoro, Luffy attacking the uh, Aqua Laguna, the freaking yep. King Bulls, gear, Frankie. Gear 2, Gear 3, Chopper. This is like no Monster comparison, Monster bro. I thought Scott Peel was like. This like, is, and like, I was naming it my favorite when we was on the train. I didn't even see all the other stuff. Was kinda, some of that stuff, only, only like 30% of that stuff happened when, when you were saying it. And like, yeah. it was still kind of like, to you, it was better. You know what I'm it saying? Was, it was just more impactful. Mm -hmm. The story was, to me, it was more fulfilling and, and like juicy yeah. because it pertained to the main, uh, the main plot. Yeah. So of course you're gonna be interested because we, because Oda barely like he, he, he kind of, he kind of like not teases us, but like only gives us like little scraps of the like the world building sometimes. So to be able to take a whole arc and like connect it to that. Is just like giving us more than what we normally get. Mm. So I was full. I was like, oh, thank you so much. This is yeah. awesome. So yeah. I'm just hoping he don't go back to like starving us. You know, I don't expect every arc to be like, you know, white water seven or, or uh in his lobby. I don't expect it. But I expect now I expect like an average, you know, a little something, something. Something, bro. Thrown in there sometimes. Like I just don't want to wait another 90 90 episodes only pertaining to that That's huh? all that stuff no, in no, between so water 7 I didn't have to wait at all water 7 in this lot because everything right. was, was everything was dope. of the main plot that's why I was like okay cool I don't care when the uh, the actual uh, world building episodes are I just don't want to go back into them arcs where we gotta wait 90 episodes until we see like a little splash of Goldie Roger or splash of Shanks and Whitebeard I don't want to go back to that I but if it happens, I'm not going to be mad. I'm just saying I see personal preference. Saying. I see what you're saying, for sure. I just when, expect it. Because when they do that stuff, it's so impactful. It's like you want more. 
Yeah. Like Shanks walking up to Whitebeard, bro. I would see that. I would watch that every episode. Ways. Like this, that was just like just a, a status on power. Even when, when you see all these arcs connecting from each other, you kind of sense that Oda's getting better with his storytelling, and he's getting better with his pacing, yeah. and he's getting better with intertwining the story, like the sub stories and like the main stories together. Yeah. How do you how do you improve from this? That's what I thought about Skypea. I don't know if you thought that, but that's what I thought about Skypea. Like, At the time Skypea was released, I didn't think about including, you know, the main story into the whole arc or yeah. the whole saga. So I didn't think about that, but I can't really think about nothing else. I don't really know what else you could do now. You know, I ain't even mentioned Kobe, bro. We saw the grown up version of Kobe, bro. Like yep. they they just mixing everything in there. Everything in there. Yeah. I don't know. The phrase that Shank said when Whitebeard asked him about his arm, he yeah. was like, I bet it all on a new era. That's that was, the uh, oldest phrase you know, ever. Uh, we need to do our like top 10, top 10 favorite phrase, One Piece phrase. characters. Oh, characters? Yeah. Okay. Top 10 so far. Video. I guess it could be like post in his lobby or something post like that. Post in his lobby. Yeah. No, we can't do post in his lobby. Why not? Because that means that's everything after. I mean, up to when it, you say man. post something, isn't it like you got to go up to that? Or we something? gotta say pre pre in this lobby, so it's, it won't be pre in that's before in this lobby. But we ain't, we don't know post because post is after. I thought post was I thought when people talk about something, post mean you stopping exactly where you at. Is that is that not right? So when you only want to talk about characters from the beginning to where you at now, and we are ending on in this lobby, I thought you would say post in this lobby. I don't even know what to even type in. I don't know. Maybe they can help us. Yeah. So but I, guess I know what up, you mean. Up until where we at, stopping at, yeah. stopping at Ennis Lobby, who are our top 10 favorite characters. I'm down. I think I already got my Why five. Why is this about already. to be crazy? Huh? I think I, I'm pretty sure I got my five already. So you want to do five each or something? Or you just want I mean, to come 10, together? 10 overall each. But Okay. You yeah. got five out of 10. Five already off the bat. You want to do a separate video or you tr- what, what you trying to do? Um, I guess we could do a separate video okay. on it. Yeah, I guess we could do a separate video and then like go through each of ours. I'm probably gonna have to rank. Do we gotta rank them? That's why it's gonna be a long video. Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna uh, get get my favorite ten, and then you're gonna get your favorite ten. We're gonna have a video, and then we're gonna go off who our favorite characters are. Favorite ten characters. This gonna include straw hats, or not include straw hats? We cannot include them. We could do two separate ones. I feel like straw hats gonna be at the top. We could so do we our straw heads one separate. Straw heads got to be tough. <sighs> I got I got some favorites over some straw heads though. I'm not even gonna lie. You got some what? Favorites over straw heads. Certain straw heads. Yeah. 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 I guess I guess we can include them. We can include them. Yeah. Not bad, but yeah, maybe we can go ahead and pop off three twenty two, and uh, which y'all don't know is we did post on our community tab that we released in three twenty two and three twenty three, but we giving y'all. All four and then the whole saga off Saturday. Let's get it because y'all know we bring that heat. That's facts. All right, you ready to get into it? Let's run it up. This next arc okay. better like make me be interested. Frankie, at two, hey man, first thing shown with butt cheeks, bro. <laughs> you hear the background, bro? What are they talking about? I have no idea. Oh my god, he's naked. Luffy just sitting there holding his drawers. Bruh. Corona out here. Y'all gotta be careful. I need a Robin figurine, man. Somebody sent me a link. Ow. That plank one right there. A man should be resourceful. He should be like. Lying against the wind. Why is it shining in the area, bro? I thought he was about to couple deep vent. Completely exposed in his parts. His eyes wide open, bro. <laughs> <laughs> He's a man of work, man. <laughs> he just <laughs> Robin ain't phased. Robin, calm down, man. I mean, watch how you talk to other dudes, man. I thought they was gonna fight him. Oh, what's the Robin wanted to touch him because he naked. Robin! The freak! They did it to you. That's why you tried to get rid of him. I ain't got nothing to do with this. This ain't my problem. How many times they gonna show that? I <laughs> said so you grabbed him. 
I never expected this. <laughs> they gonna come off. They gonna come off. We we'll use tangerines. I feel this pain right we, now. We about to have an argument tonight. <laughs> <laughs> he said it hurts just to watch. <laughs> My Frank is in pain. I they feel sorry for him. Robin, what the freak is you talking about? What is it? <laughs> Only men can understand the pain. That's why you see all these women just like. Right. I swear about to put him in his place. Mm. Just explain it yourself. Right. You, you said this, Frankie. It's like, I thought Iceberg was going to tell him that. You can't do that. That's you cheating. You said you aborted. It, he lost sight of himself. Well, it's like he really just said that he going to wait for it to do all of that. They didn't get on it. I'm sorry. <laughs> he threw a sandwich and got ready for it, bro. He was like. <laughs> Ah, uh, even perfect time to drink. Right, he got pimp slap. Man, imagine getting knocked with handcuffs on like that. He pulled the thing out after Frankie said it wasn't built to come out. He just mm-hmm. pulled it out. He man had that bandage on for a whole arc. <laughs> Usa boy is for half the episode. <laughs> Making up for it. He still got him. Bro, you need to let stuff go, man. I don't think he crying because of the moment. No cry. He ever not smile? <laughs> What's up? Anytime some smoke. Right. Uh, Frankie family threw him his bag. Oh. <laughs> These last couple episodes must be the Usopp coming on, man. Because he still ain't get his, his time to shine. <laughs> it's like the feelings hit him. <laughs> <laughs> Frankie is a funny person, bro. No, oh, I thought she was offering it to them at first. She is not playing. She ain't feeling You're gonna make him a woman? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. He said you gonna make him a woman. Robin ain't felt none in years or something, man. The freak. Get, get her plenty for him. He was just doing something last night, Robin. Chill. <laughs> He's like, I'm done. Oh. He tried to blame it on that, bro. <laughs> freaking, freaking food, bro. <sighs> I want to hire a chef. Mm. You got a cold, uh, whatever that ship head is called. I just had it mad. He looks so different. They was wearing all different types of clothes and everything. He looked way more different than before. Frankie's body. <laughs> Talk to them, Frankie. Hey. He just came and took over their stuff. Are you about to show them? Hey, they, was, they both had a uh, top and bottom. Yeah, Samurai Sword. Got them off the liquor. Thank you, man. See the hairstyle? How they get the uh, hairstyle? I like the old hairstyle better. Yeah, I thought that was Zangief. Be funny. Yeah, this man cleaned up the streets, man. Ow. <laughs> it's like giving all those orphans and people that ain't had nobody somebody. That's dope, man. Shoot, that'd be hard. It'd be hard for me to leave this, too. It's like he leaving his kids. That quick? He said he was giving you a head start or something, didn't he? <laughs> the accuracy. <laughs> I, I haven't heard him say that in a minute. Yeah, I like how he got happy. Yeah, but they all can trust him because they been in battle with him. Been through the trenches. They was with them before they even got the Frankie. He got the bikini, but he would not put it on, bro. I guess he's the first straw had to walk to get on that naked. <laughs> Lively townspeople. Hey! Oh, he sleep. <laughs> I was like, oh, he <laughs> that be messed up. I was like, bro, I ain't showing my man's like this. <laughs> oh no, nah, Luffy got that scar under his eye. I did not understand that. Thank you. Yeah, man, that's pretty dope. Yeah. That this episode is going this this pretty much uh, initiation of bringing Frankie onto I don't even know what the ship called, but just inviting him to the Straw Hats was uh, done perfectly. I like how they kind of we knew how much he cared about his like underlings, but or his and his family. But I like how they showed that backstory because because it, it made me care more and it kind of put more emphasis behind his like his his feelings because like you didn't know he brought them out of the gutter. Man. Save these two girls from drinking. Told people to get off the streets, feeding everybody that couldn't eat. 
you didn't know you did all these things and stuff. I think a lot of people need to take notice of that. Like people don't understand what people be doing, but they just take everything for the face value right. of what's in front of them. Right. So people got to learn more about that stuff, man. That's true. And finding like a way to like show it. Cause like we wouldn't even have known it if they hadn't like owed it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And yeah. I think that's the beauty of stuff is like, sometimes like Frankie, Frankie, say for instance, you had like a cassette tape of showing all the stuff he did to everybody in the past. He probably wouldn't even care to even show it. Yeah. He'd probably just be like, I'm good. Yeah. But it's good for the writer to show that because nobody wouldn't even know. Yeah. But hey. Backstories, man. Like, One Piece, this whole anime is like making me realize what makes you emotionally tied to stuff. Mm -hmm. And it's the backstories, bro. Like, every time they go into a backstory, it just makes you so much more like uh, involved in it. Right. Care, care more and stuff, and One Piece does it like beautifully to me. You know what I'm saying? When I seen those sisters coming out the alley, bro, and he, I was just like, bro, like Frankie was really a good dude. He could have took him to the girl you wanna come to my hotel. They were like 16, but yeah, I don't know how old he was at the time. Yeah, that's true. You never know. Yeah, cause he did get bigger, but reconstructing his body. But before that, he was like, you know, what I'm saying? oh shoot, Was that pause. All right, man. I didn't say nothing. You, you, you said something with your face. I was doing this. Come on, G. Now you gonna I could have like... brought it to, to attention, but I was just like, I'm going to chill. I've been chilling. Did a pause? It's okay to say it's a pause. That's a pause. I'm going to say pause. But uh, I'm ready to get to the next episode, man. You got three episodes left. What do you think the last three is going going to entail? Like, what do you think it's going to be? About? I know Usopp got to be somewhere in there. Usopp got to come. Uh, then they're going to let us know like what's going to happen. Where we going next? I think. And then you know Garp is in there too. Oh yeah, Garp coming. Yeah. So he's still there. It's probably because this episode was whole the whole episode of Frankie just kind of boarding the ship, so they yeah. can drag it out longer. Usopp could be like one episode, mm -hmm. like. It'd be two episodes. I don't know, because this was actually two episodes. This whole Frankie yeah. stuff. Like, I feel like Garp got to be involved somehow. Because I, I don't see us seeing Garp ship and then not yeah. interacting with them again. That's weird. And, and I would kind of want to want to interact and get my last piece of world building before we go to this next, <laughs> this next saga, man. That's crazy, bro. Feel for them world building episodes. This bad go ahead. Even send a little a, bit more. Uh, send a letter to Oda and just type world building on that. Oda, like, can you just send me the world building episodes? That's all I want. I'll get blue as heck. Yeah, let's do it. Got the run up. <laughs> but yeah, man, we're about to get into episode 323. Ship. God dang it. <laughs> yeah, Paul on top of I'm done. He just casually on the ship? It's crazy. <laughs> he called him a greenhorn, too. It's a lot of work going back. You want to travel by bike. Is he the only one that don't got a ship? Not black no more. I like it black. I thought we was gonna see Usopp before we sailed. He probably on here somewhere. Oh. You worried. He trying to play it off. He's sweating and everything. He's <laughs> bitching. He was right there. <laughs> this probably what Usopp was watching. Talk to him. I respect that. Mm. That's not fair. Bro, they're all awesome stuff, bro. He's speaking truth. Yes, sir. Kind of back to want to be a swordsman. A little bit. You left? You both left. We both left? Oh, jokingly because they was cutting off parts? Yeah. He agreed with Zoro. Mm. 
<laughs> Where did he go? He was outside the window the last time that he was about to say something. Hey, big old Ken in the back. <laughs> what? So I'll fight your gang all by myself. Hey man, we just built this ship. He's throwing the cannons? <laughs> Garf is a beast, bro. Climbing lately. Hey, our ship ate that though. It, it dodged it. Huh? It went to the side. He took his coat off. Oh my god. Oh I'm my get this. gosh. Taking out of there, bro. We ain't trying to fight nothing. What's up, man? I don't know how you gonna get on the ship. Anji knew he was rehearsing how to come back, so he know he was on the way. He smelled the. Oh, they can use the anything cannon to shoot him over there, probably. Yeah. Well, you do got his belt, trusty belt. I didn't know it was you. Luffy knew the whole time. Why he asked Soga King to shoot through that if he didn't know about his skills? He always said he was a sniper. Yeah. He sang the songs. Big brain Luffy? I'd be impressed if he if he knew it was him. Iconic. You don't see us getting attacked, bro? We ain't got time to be waiting on you. He got some type of turbo on the back of the ship. Seen that? Mm-hmm. That's what I was talking about earlier. Mm. Really? <laughs> what? Then he just jumped off like a seven story house or something though. <laughs> hey, break the other shift too. <laughs> this man is just tossing on bro. Bro, God, it's like that? It's about rejoice. It don't sound like he gonna like apologize when he first do get on here. It's like he, he's gathering up for it right now. Okay, we got the black flag on top top. <laughs> That's a lie, I know you can hear it. That visual crazy. Finally said it. Now they heard him. <laughs> they will try to hear all that foo foo stuff, bro. He going in, bro. <laughs> he reached out to him. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, sir. Hey, for a minute, though, I, I don't know. I thought he wasn't going to join. Hey, that's dope visual. My bad, y'all. I'll be forgetting that we be reacting. I'll be just watching. I was just... Along for the ride, just watching it, bro. <laughs> Trying to see what the heck was going to go on for everything. <laughs> so I'll be totally forgetting that I got it. I'm like, dang. I mean, it's technically a real reaction. I mean, that's a, yeah. It's technically a real reaction, but I know we'll be skipping past a lot of like the dead spots where we don't talk talk to. So, yeah, this was this was definitely an emotionally filled um, episode. This was fire, bro. Yeah. Like, he was saying all that stuff. They were just like, I can't hear it. He apologized. They instantly turned, G. That that change of like I don't know, space or perception was just that was just done. Oh, yeah. You. I I definitely disagreed with the whole with the whole apology thing. Like 
if they both would have said they apologized, I would have definitely been cool with that. But the way that they made Usopp plea and kind of beg to get back on there, I wasn't rocking with that. And it kind of all spanned on Zoro's like warrior code, stuff like that, because because he lost the battle. Eh. Most of the time, I'd be agreeing with the messages that Oda be having. I didn't agree with this one. I I feel you on that. Um, I definitely agree with it, just because I wanted Usopp to apologize, because I felt like he was wrong the whole time. Yeah, but your um, your reason it was different than what the, what they perceived as the actual real reason for him to apologize. Well, Zora was saying because you know, he lost the, the battle. One, he lost the battle, but in a sense, he was saying like. You know, yeah, he technically said he lost the battle. But he said like, he lost the battle and because he wanted to leave, but Zoro, and then Sanji said he was right, but technically Luffy told him to leave. Not saying that that... He said if he don't agree with... No, no, no. This was like before they even started, started like the actual battle. This one, he was on the ship that he told him to leave. And then, then he got offended by that and he just kept going back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And then he, and then he challenged them to a duel. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I just never agreed, agreed just in the, even at the beginning. Like, I just felt... And then after finding out that Usopp knew about the Mary, it made it even worse for me. Like, I don't know. But anyway, like... Usopp knew knew about it? I mean, yeah. we talked about that already. I still don't think you get that part. He didn't know 100% about it. Usopp? Like, yeah. He just knew that the Mary was on its, like... Was, like, nearing its end, but he didn't know that it, that it couldn't he be He never repaired. wanted to accept that... It was nearing his end or something like that. Like only I time know. I could say he didn't want to accept it was after Frankie told him. Yeah, that's that, what. I'm... Yeah, but if, <sighs> kind of feel like you was talking about like before that too. I'm talking about the whole time, like even when they first started to fight Usopp and Luffy. Yeah, I'm talking about when he after he talked to Frankie. I'm talking about even with the whole Soge King thing. Like after, to me, I wasn't. You was rocking with Soge King. I was just like, be a man and face your thing. And don't hide behind the Soge King. That's why I didn't really like Soge King until he had his, that main, that famous moment. And I was like, okay, Soge King. But like the whole time, like I just, I don't know. Only reason Zoro didn't really put nothing really on Luffy is because Luffy is supposed to be the captain. You're supposed to show that you uh strong in your subordinates, per se. Even though if I was captain, I wouldn't look at, look at it like that. Your subordinates is not supposed to be disrespectful to you. And I understand Zoro being like the warrior code. He can't really follow behind Luffy if Luffy is like taking crap from from Usopp. Usopp's not really the captain per right. se. So I definitely understood certain things that Zoro was saying, but I didn't rock with the fact that he was saying that he need to apologize mostly because he lost a duel. It's like we need like this little rule book on warrior code, stuff like that. And everybody doesn't follow the Bushido code or whatever code that he followed. Everybody don't follow that. Pretty sure Sanji don't follow it. Chopper don't follow it. It's kind of like his like personal religion. And that's the reason why he thought that he should apologize. It's very, very, it's it's very technical. strange. It's really technical in a sense. Because Sanji even said Zoro was right in this sense. Right on which talking. part about him losing? About when Zoro was talking about the whole thing about waiting on Usopp and not being the one to go to him and like mm-hmm. let Usopp come and apologize to us first. Like Sanji, they agreed with that. It know? was more of a respect thing for Zoro. Like, if you play Zoro's thing word from word back, the only thing that I could say that he was wrong on was the fact that he he think that Usopp needs to apologize because he lost the duel. It was more so on losing the duel right. rather than anything else, him knowing, him talking. It was like because he lost the duel that he challenged Luffy, he was supposed to say sorry. That's how Zoro goes about everything. Right. And everybody don't go, go by that code. Like, yeah. say, for instance, you did me wrong, and then... I, I challenge you to a fight knowing that I'm weaker than you. I lose, but I gotta say sorry to you. Yeah. That's not just. Yeah. It's kind of it's kind of it's kind of weird. Saying with the with the whole Zoro thing. That was like specific thing was technically like weird. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I do, like I said, when it first happened, I didn't agree with how Luffy told Usopp or didn't tell him. Yeah. Like his his communication was wrong. And I always said, we always said that Luffy could have told him better. Yeah. Um they just kids too, so Yeah. But that's kinda why I think it was that crazy. Yeah. Well I'm glad we all together back again. Um glad we got Frankie. 
I like the way with Chopper, like he knew Usa was there because he sniffed his nose, he smelled yep, animal them. instinct. That stuff was cold. Like everybody seemed happy once Usa got back. So I know we all still got they all got love for each other still. Yeah. Yeah, so I can take game. my hat off to uh, Zoro. Kind of like you need that second in command to kind of keep you in your place. That's really what keep they for. And stuff, yeah. And it's um more so him kind of like teaching Luffy. You know what I'm saying? Certain things. Not saying everything he teach him is right. You know what I'm saying? But uh, I did commend him for actually trying to kind of making him act more like a captain. Yeah. So that was pretty dope. Because he was like, this dude's an idiot, but he still is our, our captain. Like, right. I mess with that, bro. Yep, yep. Well, yeah, this is dope, man. I'm ready to get to the next episode. See what happened. 323, what, 24? Yep. 24, let's get it. Tokyo. Oh, I thought you said Tokyo, too. <laughs> Tokyo Drift? But uh, race cars in the... We're going to use that turbo thing on the back to get away? Yep, yeah. All right, Frankie, you always going to have some weird stuff that we can do to get out of there. Mm-hmm. I don't think Garp is really, really trying to chase us. He's just trying, trying to say that he tried to send Goku. How could he probably know? Mm-hmm. He probably don't care. Yeah, two of the main people that's letting, letting people go all the time. He said, I don't care. Go start that. <laughs> He's like, monkeys don't give up. We about to get out of here, bro. <laughs> <laughs> just a minute ago, you were... <laughs> Dang, he said, not yet. We ain't named it. Dang, I gotta name my car, man. It's the only car I got never, that I didn't name. You already departed with it, though. I could, it's Multiple better times. late than never. Multiple miles. It's better late than never. Frankie you said you gotta do it before you depart. Tiger Lion, Tiger Wolf Lion. <laughs> What's your car name? Silver Fox. Name? Oh, yeah. On the <laughs> <laughs> Mmm, kind of like King of the Jungle, King of mm. Pirates. It's not a sign. <laughs> this just shows regular about a color, a color uh, <laughs> animals, bro. Yeah, it'll show us the whole world. Thousand Sunny. Thousand Sunny. Don't play the red light. <laughs> darkness. Robin, where'd you get darkness from? Sunny. I was just to start things though. What the heck? <laughs> they talking to Oro. Damn it. Sunny. He put his head down. Thought they paid attention to him. We could just We're dip about like to be this. Traveling like that. He already said he's goodbye to the island. The Kobe and. <laughs> <laughs> he said, call my name, too. <laughs> We're going to run with all our might now. Will be so cool? <laughs> They've been selling off for a, a while, bro. Mm. So how can you say something? <laughs> it's kind of like Frankie in a sense. You put cola yeah. in it and you get stronger. And he, and he got the little fart thing in the back. So this kind of got that, too. <laughs> We're gonna die. Oh shit, man. Either we gonna dip or we gonna go gear three real quick. Hey, dip out of there. Ah, oh, shit flies. <laughs> Tayoka G. Oh, what yeah, man, you gotta, uh, man, what a tribute to the Mary. Inherited. Like one day we're gonna try to use that and, and, and the villain gonna catch up to us or probably stop us from leaving. Right. Um, That's my grandson. I hope we get to see Iceberg's completion of the uh, city floating. Oh yeah. Can't wait to see that. Oh, he said with his friends. Dang, so I mean, he's not gonna go by himself. Yeah, he's gonna go with the crew. You got one piece? 
Ah, oh, you gonna take over some stuff for him? That's dope. He giving them work. That's dope, man. New bro. <laughs> they just changed from one bro to the next. Yeah. This is freaking saga cold, man. We gotta do a top three, like, favorite moments. I can't just pick one. Might have to be top five. Man. An island on the Grand Line. Mocha? I'm about to see their new bounties. He'll tell him taste us, man. Leave us alone. Oh. Oh, man. Everybody do always read the new um bounties. Yeah, I forgot about that. We know we global. They <laughs> 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 <Hey>, focus. <laughs> they know. <laughs> Split it in bitches. <laughs> they petty, bro. He do look like a pedal on there, though. I ain't gonna stop. They bogus, bro. Luffy's hometown. Usha. I forgot it was called this. Yeah. <laughs> Old man still there. Is that what Garp was talking about? Who he left him with? I, I, ain't, I ain't seen her in a minute either. Thanks probably gonna see it because he saw the last one. Mm -hmm. She looked like that um that girl that be with um Smoker. To run free and commit such a crime. Hey, well, look at his son. Da da. Who's was da da? So, dang, we going to everywhere. This is good. Send them some panties or something oh, in the mail. So good. Back down, they look crazy man. HD. Wait, did it say 30 million? Did they finally say? Hold on. They would show it right there. Did it show it? Well, his body is 30, 30 million. million. I forgot what the whole the bets were. I don't oh, know. I forgot about that. I don't think it was a bet. That one was just guessing. I don't think we bet on Usopp though. You about to go send him something in the I mail. Think you did that, and I think you won. Luffy's bounty. I won on Luffy's bounty. I don't well, think you won we that on Luffy's bounty, and then we bet it again on Usopp. Remember, we had the whole argument with the ten. Saying, we we then we did a range. So if it was anything higher than I think 25, I said thirty five, forty five though. If it was thirty five, oh, if it was thirty five, we would have broke yeah. even. Yeah. I think I said. I think you said ten twenty. I said thirty five, forty five. I don't. I don't think nobody won it. I just said. We said if it wasn't between either of our ten, nobody wins. Oh, like if it was ten through oh, twenty, you, you said win. thirty-five to forty. I said thirty to okay. thirty-five to forty-five. Dang, I ain't seen this since we since they left. I don't trust this guy. I know you've been talking about that since the beginning. He killed his. He killed his daughter. <laughs> to tell the truth. Hmm. I mean, Okoyashi. Did you see her sister? Nojiko. Like always. A lewd wanted poster to the entire world. Just like a father. <laughs> he poured a lot of liquor out. It's a good sign, G. The world building stuff you're hoping for. Mm -hmm. The fact that they doing all of this. I feel like it's about to get, it's, they about to go even higher, G. Chaba! Sakura. Hey, he's called Sakura? Come on, man. Dr. McCole. Hey, she got, she's still, still she alive. New pet. Hey, the first zone we seen. Yep, the rhino. Out to the sun. I ain't gonna see the 50 bounty for Chopper. She's trying to get her some, some dog. <laughs> she thinks she's slick. You want to see come up here to the palace? <laughs> so the mistake. As long as I can see his face. Oh, just like a mother. A cake like that? It wasn't never like that. Oh, the yeah. old version, I think. Wow. Uh, but the old, but the old version. Oh yeah, Miss All Sunday. <laughs> this guy, cheated death. TV. Uh, Karu got biggest freak. He evolved. That's everything they do. I thought all of them was gonna die. Acting, bro. You uh, some type of people. That cut. Uh, cut. Bro, this is dead. With the cape. Hmm? Uh, that's not. Oh, it is. Okay. <laughs> they so petty, bro. At least they didn't forget it. Leave it out, hopefully. He must have grew hair. Ooh. Was he not bald? Or did we not even know? He always had his hood on. Oh, okay. But he had that Vegeta lining, though. The world's most heinous criminal people. He look colder now. With his hood off. <laughs> I'm a drinking. 
Sunny. Hey, it's dope to ask somebody else on that now. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, Fishman Island. It did say that. I wanted the Fishman Island gonna connect more to Frankie because it was kind of close to that ghost ship when when he got beat up badly or ran over by that train, yeah. and that ghost ship kind of found him. I wonder if it's gonna connect to more Frankie's uh backstory on how he came about being a cyborg. Yeah, it did seem like it connect connect with that backstory, yeah. but yeah, man, this was dope. So it was a uh, it was a dope episode. ending. Um. They pretty much follow suit on, on like the the tradition. Every time we end in, end in um, a saga, we pretty much got to go through everybody seeing seeing our updated status. Yeah. But I kind of like this version more. Yeah, this version. I guess they dope. I guess they did it better, but I expect it because you know as you progress you get better. So yeah, I was hoping that Shanks would see it, but they did already show saying Shanks. Yeah. So. <laughs> Oh, they showed them already. <laughs> they showed them. But yeah, this is dope. What do you think about the name of the uh, ship, Sunny? Thousand Sunny. Um, it has more meaning than the Going Merry, but I don't think the Going Merry was more like was supposed to really. It wasn't set up how the Thousand Sunny was set up to have right. a lot of meanings. Um, the one thing I don't really like, I know that they kind of portrayed the Going Merry to be like the thou the Thousand Sunny to be kind of like an improvement of the Going Merry. Focusing on what the Going Mary couldn't really do. Yeah, I didn't like that. I didn't like that part, and I didn't like the fact that we didn't have any type of thing that symbolized the Going Mary. You know what I'm saying? Like whether we had the mask somewhere or, or that or a little, a little head somewhere, like mm -hmm. something, something that gives us, you know what I'm saying, so we can remember the Going Mary by just remembering in spirit. I mean, that's cool and all, but I felt like it would have been a better tribute. To give to give that ship something that the going Mary had something that physically yeah visually they could see yeah you'd be like hey I put this I, I use this wood from the going Mary on this particular plank so y'all could always you know had a going Mary with y'all I, I agree with Ooh, that bam that, that would have been cool but that's fine yeah yeah I think it's uh, dope uh, I like the way we could like basically move like we falling down from Scott Pia in a sense if we yeah. got if we got the color for it. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So we can like travel distance faster. We ain't gotta like wait all day to get to the next island yeah. and all of that stuff. And then with Nami on board, I'm sure she's gonna figure out better ways for us to move around too. So then we got Frankie's fixed. We ain't gonna need we ain't gonna never need no we ain't yeah, gonna never see no key? patching. It's gonna be pristine. There ain't yeah. gonna be no patches, no yeah, no band-aids, it's gonna be pristine. Yeah. I like that part. Yeah, it's gonna be dope, man. But yeah, this is dope. I'm ready to get to the last episode of the Whew, man, we made it. Saga. We made it. I, man, episode. I didn't know when, when we was gonna get to this. At the end of the art, it's always an extra ten. That's like finishing up, wrapping up stuff. This is very true. <laughs> I don't know what else we can get besides getting to the either getting to the next island, but this might be. Uh, I don't know. Like I felt like the real building was um Shanks and all of them and stuff like that. But yeah, we'll see. We'll yeah. see. Let's get into it. Let's go, man. Episode 325. Just saying, we figured that we should give y'all these last four because it's the ending of the of the actual saga. Mm -hmm. Might as well call it a season. I know One Piece don't got seasons. And mo mostly, we kind of like the stack so we can be able to provide y'all stuff on time. In the flow of time. We come to question the word that's gonna be weird when he meet his father. Yeah, he actually know who he is. Yeah. Well, the name is. I want I want people to feel like this with us when we make it. Facts. When our bounties get bigger. We had like thirty million right now, maybe fifty. We gotta we gotta figure out the, uh, the pacing of the bounty. I would say we at thirty right now. Hundred K, we gonna be at hundred mil. That's Blackbeard. Blackbeard. What? Oh, they just showed the group. He laughing. He pulled one crazy stunt. He got a coat now too. Looks like he top top of the tower just moved down and going to sky right after, after that. Not that far from here. They about Crew. to come for us. What you mean unfortunate, bro? We got an body some people. Y'all got a ship? <laughs> oh snap! Hey, so we found him. 
Three days before? The Naro Island on the Grand Line. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm excited for this. I don't want to hear title. I don't even want to hear it in Japanese. I don't care. I don't want to hear it. Can you, uh, can you have me my ace figurine? Okay, I'm about to lock in. I don't talk a lot. It's not my fault. Yeah, you can press play. I didn't think they was gonna meet this early. Mm. My chest is beating hard. He said, let's cut the idol talk. Ace pulled up on their whole, on his whole little crew. Huh? <laughs> Disrespect. What? You just said you gonna kill his brother. He really about to die. So he trying to be the next pirate king, G. Mm -hmm. I thought he was trying to do the whole emperor thing. He didn't know that? <laughs> oh my God, bro. He shot at him? Not phased. This is our first time seeing him like Logia, like something yeah. like made of fire. A lesson in manners, that's facts. This man shoot guns, yes. oh. And we also getting a sight of um a freaking Blackbeard's crew too. Yeah. Oh my god! Dude, this is the best. You don't stand a chance. She said sorry. Like, bro, we know you got more than this, bro. It's dope as heck to see Asian in action, bro. This is cold. Oh my God. We gotta see what Blackbeard about to do now. And Shakes wanted to call this off, but how was he gonna reach him in time and tell him to call this off? The music. Ah, oh, we about to see what Blackbeard got. About to see what he did against Shakes. Commander Thatch. Look your devil fruit. See, I had thought about this, like, what was the what was the implications behind him murdering this person? Like, did he have a choice? Like, like maybe they didn't understand what happened behind that, but then again, you got Whitebeard who's like, everybody's my son, you're not supposed to kill him regardless of what. Right. But it seems like that was a rule that got broken, and the Blackbeard's like... Right. But I'm, I'm about to keep saying Man, he was just using her. Or just took a bite out of it. Why are you sleeping? Oh, shoot. Even for, for a Logia. He's a Logia? You got this Thanos rings on. It's ash smoke. You got a cold sound. Darkness? darkness. That's something. Man's on the stretcher. What, is, what does darkness do, though? Like, what can you do with this darkness, bro? Evil power and devil fruit history? Dark, dark, dark fruit. fruit. What the? He's like, okay. Go ahead and try. Freak out of here. Oh, they running? His own crew is running, bro. We wear those rings for show. What is he doing to the whole playing field, bro? Why are you not running? Oh. <laughs> bro, what is he doing? Tyler running insane at the same time. Gravity. Oh, it's like a suction. Blackbeard is a cannibal, G. He had to have Aiden, that dude. <laughs> he gonna cut out on his on his <laughs> taking the town down moment. <laughs> boy, they be cutting out at the weirdest times, boy. I swear. People worked hard for this, and you just where does all this stuff go? Destroying it for no reason. He's like, let me show you what my devil fruit can do. Dang, he took away the whole village, bro. What the heck? I ain't even do nothing to you. Hey, that's what I want to see. So, does the guy to come back out? I mean, like, I don't even know these people, and that sucks, bro. Ace don't seem phased at all. What was that? What the heck? Firefly, fire dog. He like shut up, burn. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> he got some Gara type stuff, bro. 
He a reject Logia? Ah, oh, shoot. What else can you do? No! Hey, so! Thor. How's he gonna get away from this guy? I'm in his burn. Also, if he touched him, he's, he's kind of like the the Luffy for Logias, bro. And Logias was like the ones that's like can be untouched. You can pull him in with your vortex, touch him, and then damage him. Hey, so she's like, I still bleed. I'm about to say, what happened to the flame? <sighs> Why he touching him? I see what Shanks was talking about. He's probably trying to fill it out. He got him though. Ooh, I'm like them things hurt. He messed up some vertebrae. He's got yeah, tons of freaking. He trying to take him out. Oh, Ace. Who would have thought we getting the Ace versus Blackbeard fight uh, no. in the last episode? This is what I'm talking about. <laughs> Thank you, Oda. I see why Blackbeard. A little more uh, harder than I thought. They talk about fate a lot. That's cool. I wonder what's going to stop this fight. Want your power? Oh. Mm. Got up his sleeve. Mm, that sound is so weak. He making a song. God dang! Man made a flame spirit bomb. This is too cold, bro. Trigger for mass man is soon about to take place. What else is about to oh, happen? Oh. Wow. <sighs> that was amazing. Wow. I didn't expect that. I really did not expect that, bro. That was fire. Yeah. Yeah, that was cold. That was the last thing I was expecting. To see an Ace vs. Blackbeard, bro. Dark, dark fruit. What you think about the dark, dark fruit? OP. OP. Ace, Ace standing up against it, though. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, he probably ain't got it mastered. Who knows? Probably do got it mastered. But Ace was showing out, too. He yeah, had, he, had, he had a plethora of moves, bro. That stuff, that stuff was cold. Yeah. He was doing some crazy stuff like that crossfire. Uh, I did not expect that fight. Did not expect. I thought they was gonna be like, "Hey, oh, we see each other next time on One Piece," and then it flashed <laughs> to the next to the next season. But but to deliver something like that at the end, that was like, monumental. That was dope, man. That was, that was dope. fire. That was dope. Whew. I got man. to see him, bro. Oh man. Then I think you said something last episode about um. Last time we seen like Buggy was he was with Ace and him and all of that. Yeah. Or something like that. So yep. it's cool we got to see Ace like where he is at now. He finally caught up to him. Blackbeard, bro. I wonder when I know we had Shanks and White and Whitebeard meet and they said this was three days ago from the incident. So I wonder if like Shanks Shanks was meeting Whitebeard, it probably happened already. Yeah, or well, yeah, around that same time. They don't I guess they didn't know where exactly Ace was. Yeah. Dang it. I'm I'm interested to see I think the fight is cool and all, but I'm interested to see the conclusion, like who wins or if somebody gonna jump in and stop one another from killing the other person. Like I don't think need like n I don't think neither one of them is gonna be like like killed in this fight. I oh. feel like they both just too strong of characters to just progress. Like Yeah. Yeah. It's crazy. This, how, this is fire. You know how they show like they show Ace hat on the floor. Mm-hmm. Kind of insinuating as if he lost. Right. But like they could be doing that to be trying to trick you and stuff too. 
Then they but, said like some crazy, some crazy stuff about to happen soon. Yeah. What what else is about to go down? Okay, this is making me excited for the next for the next uh arc, you know, arc saga, but it better not be no like it don't happen for like 80 episodes. Then I'm not gonna be excited. Yeah. So I better see it right away. Or older, I'm gonna be at your front doorstep. That's crazy. I think, but, uh, I think I'm playing. I got your address. I don't. <laughs> I will get it though. Dang, so the Dark Dark Fruit is dark, technically dark fruit a Logia, is but it's not like the regular Logia. Logia I wonder know. what can combat it. Like, I know, I don't think, no, it'd be simple. It'd be Light Light Fruit. I might have Light Light Fruit and they defeat Blackbeard, but it seems like Blackbeard is, has some, has a Logia that's about to be going crazy in this world. Like, he's setting up to be that, to be that villain. You know what I'm saying? And I thought he was like, I know he was trying to capture Luffy, but I thought he was kind of cool with him in a sense. But he over here talking about he want to kill him. him. I'm he like, dang! I then, thought he just he was cool. They lie. <laughs> not cool. They lie. Then he wanted to be. The, he actually wants to be the king of pirates. Yeah. Like, that's just, I didn't. Did we know that before? I mean, I kind of got it when, when I was talking about it when uh, Shanks was saying he trying to take your seat, and I think Whitebeard right now is seen as like the. He's uh, the strongest. Like, yeah. Like, I think he's seen as the king of pirates, but I think you got to get that title. But I think he's seen as like that person to, to like that person that's in first place. And like, he's like LeBron James right now. Okay. And, and he's like, makes sense. He's trying to climb to that, to that top spot. You know what I'm saying? But do you think Blackbeard is mopping shanks or white mopping right now? I don't think mopping, Not mopping but do you think he can beat them? Whitebeard? Heck no. Heck no. If he can't, do I think Blackbeard is mopping Whitebeard? I don't want to say mopping anymore. I just Do I think Blackbeard beating. is beating Whitebeard? Yeah. And that's his facial expression you made, like, as if you on the other side. You think he could beat Whitebeard? Well, you said, well... I said, heck, he no. Okay. He's he not, he not beating Whitebeard. If, if he's having Chase a problem... I said and Whitebeard, but you only said Whitebeard. He not... He said he not I don't doing. think he's beating Whitebeard or oh, Shanks. Okay. If he's having trouble getting... Ace right now, and he hasn't even really defeated Ace right now. Heck, you know, he's not even messing with them two yeah, right now. But sure. Shanks did get, got scarred up. He got scarred up. Now, I don't want to give him the handicap. He probably was not even really trying to kill Blackbeard, or he probably was not trying to, or he probably had one arm. We don't know what happened. We don't know what happened, so I, so I don't know. Yeah. Plus, Shanks, people like Shanks, but we don't know if Shanks got a death or not. I don't know if we know that for real. <sighs> But Mihawk, you got something. Blackbeard stuff don't really kind of work on them because they don't have powers for him to absorb in a sense or to stop. Yeah, you yeah. know what I'm saying. So if he try to do that, Shanks, his stuff, his stuff is just mostly. I mean, I still, I still think it's OP, yeah. but I think it's really OP versus Devil Fruit users. Yeah, yeah. but I, but I still think it's OP versus people that don't even have a Devil Fruit exactly. also because yeah. it's it's, it's freaking darkness, darkness. Like this dude is just swallowing stuff up. It's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, I I don't think he beaten Whitebeard. I don't think he beaten uh, Shanks either. I don't think he beaten Mihawk. Like, yeah. no. Yeah, mm -mm. I don't think he beaten Mihawk either. Right now, those three, I'll probably throw Sengoku up there. You know what I'm saying? The Admiral's up there. I feel like those are like the S classes right now for me. Yeah. And nobody like like mopping them at all. Yeah. Like Sengoku, Dragon, the Admirals. Whitebeard, Shanks, and Mihawk. Yeah, Those to me is my is my uh core people that's just like overpowered. Not overpowered, but just they strong. like the legends right now. Yeah. Nobody touching them. Yeah. Nobody's touching them. It's crazy. I will say, now that we finally seen Ace catch up to Blackbeard, mm -hmm. from the first time we saw Ace, episode 94, um, he was talking about how he was going after Blackbeard. Yeah. I was thinking in my head, like, bro, Blackbeard. I didn't think he was catching no up to like 400, 500. Yeah, but I didn't think Ace was... I didn't think Blackbeard was, like, even comparable to Ace in strength-wise. Mm -hmm. Because they sent him by itself. Yeah. And stuff like that. But now seeing them fight and stuff... Yeah. That's, but like, that just shows how much respect Whitebeard got for uh, for Ace, shoot. Yeah. And and I want to see the backstory on why Ace is so, is so adamant on making Whitebeard the actual king. Yeah. So I want to see that, like, what yeah, gave him that, that view, like, man... I gotta help this dude out. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I don't want to say that he's 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 a Zoro to uh to Whitebeard, but I want to see 
how he came to believe in believe in white beer like that Which so much. Sense. Yeah, makes sense. I, I can I already see why, but I want to see like that personal, that personal connection and stuff yeah. and what happened in the past and how you brought him up and like that because he he had to get that somehow coming from chilling with Luffy and all of them and probably Shanks. Yeah. So I definitely want to see more of that going forward. This was dope, man. This episode, Oof. this stuff that has been happening, G, it's like really making me excited about. Out of all four Olympics. episodes, this was at all for the previous four episodes. This this was the one. I'm glad it ended like this. I'm definitely yeah. glad because because it makes you want to see what happened next. Yeah, what happened next, and yeah. then it give us that little that little cheap little. Oh, they about to fight each other next time. No, right. they gave us some they some, some, some heat. Showed us what's going on. Yeah, I'm I enjoy ready. that. I enjoyed it. And they always doing some like previous days with, with uh, Ace. Even even when they was talking about that it didn't um it didn't uh like snow or nothing like that for like a couple days and that was before they got there. It was before the Straw Hats got there. Like uh, Ace they always uh, doing yeah. some like three days ago with Ace. They always going like backwards with Ace for some reason. Yeah. I don't know why that's such that's a trend, but it's not yeah. it's not nothing crazy. Yeah, but this is dope, man. Hope y'all enjoyed it. This is finally yeah. the end of the Water 7 Enos, Navi, Enos Lobby saga, and we definitely enjoyed it. Big facts. Would you say this would be a tough saga to beat? We I don't about think the Scott next arc going to beat it. I'm sorry. I don't know. I don't think the next arc going to beat it unless it's going to be something crazy. I'm saying. It I, better be something crazy. I'm the same way. I'm the same and it, way. And it can't even be just a part. Like, say, for instance... Like, say for instance, the next part got two parts. Yeah. They got a Water 7 that was S class, and they got an Ennis Lobby that was C. Yeah. I'm still putting Water 7 Ennis Lobby over it. Like, I'm yeah. sorry. Like, I don't care. Like, this was consistent from beginning to end. This was consistent fire. from beginning to end. It had it had S S ranks moments in each part. Yeah, each did. Water 7 was S S S class. And this lobby was S class. The right. ending, the beginning was S class. The ending was S class. The world building was S class. Everything was S class. Was there was no fall off point. Only fall off point to me was just getting through CP9 a little bit. Like some of the train scenes, you know what I'm saying? It had a little bit of stuff, but going to the gate, opening it was the going, gate was, yeah. Was, uh, it had a little bit, but it wasn't like no crazy. No, like it? it wasn't dragging like that. It wasn't dragging like that. So yeah. I don't think nothing beating this for like a good minute. I was saying kind of the same things with Skype here, but I'm believing really hardly on this one. Right. I'm putting my money on this one. Right. It might be, it might, it might be a part that was that was probably like the best, but I don't think it's gonna be no body of work yeah. for a saga. Overall, better. Yeah, yeah, was no body of work for a saga. Yeah, yeah. I yeah. agree with that. But yeah, hope y'all enjoyed it. You know what I'm saying? Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Yeah, make sure you check these videos out on our Patreon before we put them on YouTube. Thanks, double dragon out. Peace. Deuces.